villagers. This month, we've seen the unveiling of the builder's latest project, the 12th of the town halls. Let's get some hype in the chat, boys. Are we ready? Let's go. Town Hall 12, baby. Come on. It would appear many of you were ready. Congratulations to Chief Dogbox. Great name. Who was the first to upgrade to the shiny new town hall? Enjoy the festivities, Chief. The builder has been going at it hammer and top. Well, mainly hammer. To create his new siege workshop. After nailing that, he was proud to roll out the siege machines. To which Chief Osamura Lenzi responded, Wow, the cool I like, the very good. Before signing off with a loving round of applause. Some seemed almost too excited to see the giant's next level attire. Chief Ipra Hugger exclaims, Look, a giant! Whilst other villagers shared their condolences for Wallbreaker. Nah. Worry not, villagers. Young Wallbreaker still has a bright future ahead of him. <clears throat> now a word from our sponsors. If you need a bright spark to help you light up your Town Hall 12, turn to Test Labs Incorporated. Unofficial sponsors of the Clan Game. Back to the renovations, which have been hammered jam-packed with a season of upgrades. And by Goblin, did you love them? And a new troop has flown into the village. The love for Electro Dragon was electrifying. Chief Mohit Sheikh even suggested a union with Super Pekka. And General Tony laid down a Sherbet Towers challenge. Don't forget to give this tiny chief a little shout out. Here's to you, Chief Ninja Junior. Pat on the head. And last but not least, the first TH12 tournament saw the Red Balloons rise to victory against the Blue Dragons. Great face, Kazuki. Happy clashing, villagers. Thank you.